Hey everybody, it's Mike, the Digital Nomad, and I'm doing my first video on the ultimate Digital Nomad vehicle that I, that I ordered the other day. It is going to be a Tesla Model X, and I want to catch up on a little things I've been doing right now. You can see it's the 19th of December, 2016. I placed my order for my Tesla on December 17th, two days ago, and when I say order, I want to describe the process. The way you order Tesla is you go online and you make a deposit if you're actually going to order a vehicle that's not in inventory. And that's what I did. I wanted to order a specific one because what I ordered ended up being a Model X. I started out the process with a Model S because I figured right now is a good time to buy one of these S's or X's if you're going to be doing a lot of driving because of unlimited supercharging. They're ending that unlimited supercharging for any vehicle ordered after you must order before the end of this month coming up and take delivery by the end of March. And I know there's about right now that the Model X's are delivering in in March right now. So this is like the last opportunity. They may even have a, you know, a cutoff at some point in time before the end of December for the Model X's because the delivery is so far out. Model S's are delivering, it seems like, within about a month. But Model X's are still about three months out at least at this point in time, from, from what I've learned from contacting Tesla. So this is the main site. This is where you do everything. Really, this is where I've done everything. I've done What I've done is gone to their website, and I've communicated a little bit through Tesla via email. And on the website, of course, before you make your deposit, you have the choice of paying in cash or doing a lease or doing a loan. Let me let you know about those things. I chose to do financing. So I went on the Tesla website here, and I applied for financing. Um, and let me show you what the main screen looks like when you're actually considering your vehicle. Like this is my vehicle right here, and I'm I'm on model model X, which is the SUV version, the higher version. And let me also mention the way I the reason I went with model X is because I do off roading. I have some property that I have that has no roads to it. And I know you're technically not supposed to do any off roading, or they're saying it's not designed for off roading. But I'm doing, uh, I'm not, it's very mild off-roading, but I need higher ground clearance. So that's why I needed to end up going with the Model X. So I was going to go with a, a lower base model, Model S originally. And, you know, I'll be using supercharging all the time. So I needed to get increased range. So I, I, I ended up wanting to step up to a 75. Then I realized I needed the increased ground clearance. So I went to the X over the S and I went to the 90 to get an equivalent range uh, for this Model X over the Model S because it's a heavier, I guess it's a little bit heavier, but it's less aerodynamic, so you've got to go to a bigger battery pack. So I've got the 90 on mine. And I just want to show you what this looks like. It defaults to the lease payment all the time because I guess that's the lowest payment you get. But you've got three choices to look at here. The loan, which is what I'm getting. There's the estimated monthly payment. Uh, cash that's the cash price which is wow that's a lot of money for a vehicle but for me i'm going to be taking advantage of the free supercharging the warranty probably which is the unlimited mileage for eight years and you know this is this is why i'm going with this vehicle for my lifestyle anyway oh and the self-driving of course they just made self-driving available last month they did a video on that or actually it was october i think it was any vehicle produced after october so Let's see, look at the details of this. Here, this is the details of the loan. So if you're doing financing and the great the rates are great through Tesla, the service is great, you know, this is the best way to go. My estimated loan payment is gonna be fourteen forty a month. That's like the house payment. It's a big house payment. My lease would be about the same, a little bit less. And there's a detail in the cash. Forget they always put these credits in here, like your you're going to take that directly off the price of the, of the vehicle, and, and it will come off the price of the vehicle, but it's not going to be, if you're paying cash, you're not going to see it for a little while in most cases. So we'll, we'll keep the loan screen up there. You can see the choices on the Model X. I went with the D. No, I'm sorry, the D. They're all dual drive systems, but 257 miles of range on the 90. The step up to the 100 gives a little bit more mileage, but it's a dramatic increase in the cost. Let me just show you what the difference in the cost is, which is why I did not go with the 100. Okay. Cash price as cost after savings. But, you know, again, it's over a $100,000 vehicle. Well, let's see, watch it jump up. 95000 to 135000 That is a massive jump. So let's put it back. Okay. 
There we go. Oh, I hit the done button. And this net, this website is actually fairly easy to navigate, but occasionally it does have some issues like that. Let's see. What do I need to do? I need to scroll down. Edit design again. Let's go back and look at the design. I just want to show you a few things on the screen about what you look at in the design and what I did. When you scroll down, you've got different options. It tells you about the standard equipment, interior layout. Okay, I went with the five seat interior because these seats fold down in the back with five seat. You get 88 cubic feet of storage, which is huge, which is what I need. I need all the storage I can get. It's gonna be mainly me driving this vehicle all the time. Here's more options. Enhanced autopilot, got that. Full self-driving capability. That is why I'm buying this vehicle. If they didn't introduce that, I wouldn't have bought it. And this is a little window of opportunity where you can get full self-driving and free supercharging for life. That's going to benefit me for sure with my lifestyle. Premium upgrade package, you got that. And you get some kind of leather steering wheel, I think, in this thing. You get the HEPA filter, which is what I want. I'm not going to get any of the leather armrest or steering wheel because I'm not getting leather. Mine's going to be a vegan vehicle. I made a purposely, uh, purpose choice to do that. Smart air suspension that's automatically included with the Model X's. Sub-zero weather, not getting it. I don't spend much time in northern climates. High fidelity sound, not getting it. I've heard it's not worth it. I'm not gonna be. I don't listen to the radio that much. I, I I'm on the internet a lot, but I'm not really a critical audiophile. And most of the st systems are pretty darn good these days. Towing package, getting that. I actually want to put the hitch on the back. I want to carry my mountain bikes or something like that. High amperage car charger. I'm not getting it. You can always upgrade later. And fine print. And let me go up here. Up here on the top is where you can choose your paint. Actually, let me move the screen down so you can see it. What my vehicle is going to be. Choose your paint right here. I'm choosing black, solid black. Everything else is an upgrade. All these other ones, additional money. Wheels, what I've got is a standard. Everything else is upgrade. Not not choosing them to not not wanting to pay anymore. It's already too damn high. <laughs> and then the interior, multi pattern blacks. What I'm getting, I like the all black dark interior. You could go with the white. Let me just click on this real quick. This white is is the uh, the, the, the vegan option they've touted, but it's white and it's not perforated, which is fine by me, but it's white and it gives a white dashboard and door components. I'm concerned they're going to yellow over time. That's my main concern. And I'm probably going to use seat covers anyway on the black, so that won't matter that much to me. So go to the oh, no carbon fiber upgrade. I want to go back multi pattern black. Okay, there we go. Anyway, let's finish up this video real quick. It's dragging on. There's my vehicle. And you can click on the design, take a look at it too. Here it is. I ordered it, like I said, on the 17th. The way the ordering process works is now the 19th. I have till the 24th from the 17th. I don't know how many days that is. A week, I think it is, to make any changes to my design. And once that week passes, they will start production on the vehicle or put it in line to be produced. Mine's going to have to be in line. And at that point, I cannot make any changes to the vehicle. So... Let's see what I've got here. You can see what you saw before. This is like a summary. It's 88,000 base price. You can see what I've got here. Multi-pattern black. It's a vegan interior. Everything's black in my vehicle. Supercharging enabled, included. Enhanced autopilot, self-driving capability. All these things I need for my lifestyle. Towing package too. And I'm also going to take advantage of the code that you can use to get a thousand dollars off by the referral code that's ending in the middle of january as well so all the good stuff's ending referral codes are ending supercharging's ending but at least you get all this right now in this little window of opportunity and you get the full self-driving capability and one last thing since i had a model s originally i did the financing on the model s they have to change over my finance to the, to the model x they're going to do that all behind the scenes. They're going to add this referral code behind the scenes. I'm just waiting because I did this two days ago on Saturday. And I'll right now it's a Monday morning. I'll probably be hearing from everybody um, on today and find out about that. And I'll keep you informed with the progress. Thanks for watching. Bye.